Hariyo. So the continuation of the class. In fact, we concluded the previous session to understand the difference between a yogi and a common mortal in this session. But before that, I would like to say something. As we have been talking about the CBP, CBP, CBP and having repeated, repeatedly saying that CBP is not a Japam to be, what do you call, uh, chanted regularly with the beads in your hand and all. But still some people get stuck and they say okay how about modifying it modifications will not work it is the vigilance which has to be ceaseless and to be perceived is what is required. As one said that Swamiji, when I keep on repeating Om Namo CBP Amara Brahma Kumara Shaktiyai Namaha I keep on saying this, I keep on remembering of CBP, I keep on remembering of what you taught me about the ceaseless perseverance and the vigilance of the mind. No, my dear friends. After some time that becomes mechanical. And remember, these are all not said by Kumar. It's all said by the scriptures. So please do not add any mortal names there. And definitely not this. Hmm? If you really want that thing to be in your uh, mind and if you feel that you keep on forgetting like that uh, Surya in a movie called Gajani, then have a wonderful bracelet on your right hand. And on that bracelet, you can have either a Shri, Om, Swastika, something like that. Looking at that, that reminds you to think of only Shri, Swasti and Om, that which are permanent. That can take an option. So, if it is your right hand, whenever you move, you know, it makes it when it moves, it is visible. Whenever you lift your hand and move, then the mind gets focused on that which is permanent. What is permanent is that which stands during the three periods of time unaltered, unchanged. So that way that will be a suggestion. In fact, even that no externalities are required, my dear friends. If the mind is alert, no externalities are required. <laughs> Isn't it? 
we don't have a list of things for example you are making something you are cooking something and you keep it there and uh, somehow you come out somebody at the door you come to the door and see and again you get back and you see that there is a lizard fallen there in the cooked food the whole food you give it to other bhutas or something bhutas are not living creatures you just throw it out so that some other creatures can take yes that lizard poison may be poisonous for human but for some others no it is not so they consume or mother earth which accommodates everything takes it to takes it into her womb isn't it so the knowledge should be that clear in the mind that anything belonging to the world that gives pleasure is equivalent to poison it is not permanent and keep on rejecting it and what remains is the self right so today we are going to take up 269 so this 269 goes like this yani sha sarva bhutana tasyam jagharati samyami जाग्रतिशा पश्य मुने सो हियर इट्स इंटरेस्टिंग टू सी द कॉन्ट्रॉस ऑफ परसेप्शन ऑफ पीपल ऑफ रियलाइजेशन एंड कॉमन the first one goes like this sarva bhutanam for all beings means for common people or common man ya that which is nisha nisha is not the name of a girl nisha is night tasyam in it samyami that is a man of self control jagarthi is wakeful yasya in which bhutani the beings jagarthi are awake sa in that nisha again night pashyata of the seeing mune he the sages the word to word meaning is like this ya nisha sarva bhutana tasyam jagarati samyami yes मुनेस इन वॉट normal men see as light or the contra where the beings are awake in those areas the muni is rest or sleep or don't see why this then does it mean to say that all this 
nocturnal creatures are all stages like the owl bat cats and other things because they are wakeful in the day so they are sorry they are wakeful in the night when men go to sleep or do smugglers dacoits and all illicit works that happens or the old monies because when the world is awake they are sleeping and when the world is asleep they are awake all these 24 bath one call centers who work in the night mm. think about it we'll continue this in the upcoming session thanks for being with krishnam vandi jagat guru